Understanding Harry Potter Villains Malfoy Draco's father raised him to take pride in his family's dark history. He grew up learning how they fought in the war to defeat those lesser than them, and so at Hogwarts, Draco excels in class and bullies inferiors to echo that legacy. But when Voldemort finally returns, the war begins anew. And so suddenly, honoring Malfoy's name didn't mean teasing classmates. It meant raising a wand and doing as his father had done. But when Draco is chosen to assassinate Dumbledore, despite mustering all his resolve, his pride, and his skill, he just can't do it. Malfoy wants to maintain his family's legacy, but he'd never seen war before. And after watching friends die, family commit atrocities, and enemies show him kindness, he struggles to believe he's on the right side. In the end, Draco doesn't rise up a hero or a villain. Instead, he stands frozen, lost somewhere in between.